Good afternoon, group. Today it's the last day of April, 2000, uh, the 30th of April, 2020. And this is our on-screen B2 plus group. In class, we have Bobby and Bogdan, and maybe um, Danny will join us later in the classroom. So we are going to talk about art, about ballet, about performance arts, about making films with modern uh, equipment and computer generated imagery. And in, in a way, we're going to introduce vocabulary on art. Okay, so to start with, let's look at the vocabulary list suggested to us for the very first activity today. So just have a look at the um, module objectives. The vocabulary is on about art, different types of genres, idioms. The reading is about computer generated imageries in films. The grammar is, oh, this is quite good grammar. Passive, but not only the passive voice, but personal, impersonal constructions and reflect, reflexive impacting pronouns, which are very important in terms of exam taking. And the listening is about radio interview. And the speaking is what to watch on TV, comparing and contrasting photos. And at the end, you have to write a review of a film. I think you did this with David, by the way. Did you do that with David? A review of a film. I think so. Yes. yes I, I think agree. you've been doing that with him. Actually, when Bogdan joined the class, we were doing unit five, I remember. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, Bogdan, uh, okay, let's go through the first uh, part of the lesson. Vocabulary. Okay, so listen and repeat these words. Are you familiar with their meaning? Okay, let's Stage. Read. Stage. Yeah, what? Scena, really. Lighting see. effects. Lighting effects. Special visual effects created by lights. Okay. Live. Live performance happening now. Release. Yeah. How would you say? Книгата беше пусната в разпродажба на 1 януари. Богдан. How would you say that? Release. Yeah. Пай пускане. No film, кино. No film, no disc. So, книгата или филма беше пуснат на 1 януари. The book the was, film was re released mm -hmm. on 1st of January. That's right. Focus on, you're familiar with this expression. Focus on, be inspired. And this is a good one. The British of the Conven. Be inspired. Be inspired. Works of art. Works of art. Works of art. Works of art. Exhibition. Exhibition. You're familiar? This was Art movement. Yes. Exhibit. 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 Exponat. Exhibit. And so check it out to show something publicly. To is the изложа, the покажа в музей. Landscape painting. Това са пейзажите. Landscape painting. A painting of a scene in the countryside. Cast. These are the people or the actress in a film, a play or a show. They are the cast. Full house. Full house. If the theater is full house, all the seats are sold out or reserved. Full house. Be performed. You know that to be put on stage. And last one audience. is audience. Okay, so let's start doing exercise number one. Okay, so what form of art is shown in this picture? Look at the pictures in the book, in the screen. What form of art is shown in each picture? Bobby, can you read the first one? Na computer ne pokazao ništa. Vi ste nas pe fajovat. Takali, a zašto mi kazate? 
Вие сте, не сте гледали нищо до момент. That's why I, because I was going through the vocabulary list. Okay. So, look at these pictures and the 19th century landscape displayed at National Gallery. What kind of art do you think it's going to be? Landscapes, yeah? It's a maybe what? National Gallery, it shows what? Some kind of exhibition, yeah. isn't it? Yeah? Maybe art? Art. Exhibition. Yeah, art so exhibition. you can write down an art exhibition. Just write it down. An art exhibition. Okay. The classical ballet is performed to perfection. So this is going to be what kind of performance? Yeah, this is ballet. 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 Double T, double L. Ballet performance. That's what they're talking about. Ballet performance. Crowd blown away by rock hits. Oh, what is this going to be? The music. Yeah, concert. crowd blown. Значит, пата е издухана от рок хитове. Maybe this is a rock, what? Concert. Maybe a rock concert. <coughs> Think about that. Released on DVD. Huh? This is what? Maybe a film. a film. Maybe let's say a crime series could be anything. Right. TV series. Okay. TV series. Crime investigation example. And finally, theater classic is given a new lease of life. Yeah, this is gonna be what kind of art? Театрално представление, може би, нали? A theatrical performance. Ето и домичката. Theatrical play. Say it together. Theatrical play. Theatrical play. Theatrical play. Така, запишеме тази страница and move to the next page. So, so, so. That's it. Mouse. That's it. Okay, now complete the reviews with the words from the list. Bobby, you try. Uh, radio had performed uh, uh, uh -huh. live in, yes. in front of Packet Stadium of Rock Fans last night. The uh, Maybe the stage. Stage was illuminated by spectacular, spectacular lighting mm -hmm. effects, and mm -hmm. the audience was roused by their old hits and newest rele releases. Releases, Chutesm. The audience was roused, roused, roused by their old oh. hits and newest. Great. And now the next one is for you, Bogdan. You should complete the, word, the missing... The, the latest mm -hmm. exhib exhibition, exhibition at the, yes. the National Gallery has paintings from the French masters such as Monet and Courbet. This one is focused on their landscape paintings. It uh, also includes uh, works of art created by other artists who were inspired by the French countryside. The paintings are separated into two large open spaces and based upon two different art Mm, movements. The first room exhibits the impressionists and the second the realists. Okay, so do you understand the text? I hope yes. you understand it. The thing is that when you have to use this vocabulary, it's quite difficult, isn't it? So you should build up your vocabulary. Includes works of art, 
created by other artists were inspired by the French countryside. Okay. So let's move on to the next uh, paragraph for you, Bobby. The last one. <coughs> Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet has been uh, performed mm -hmm. performed in British theaters countless times. Yes. But the play has come to life once more at the Cambridge Shakespeare Festival. Mm -hmm. There is a uh, full, house, uh, mm -hmm. full house every night and audiences are left astonished by the great performances of the cast. Of the cast. Yes. Super, много добре се справяш. Така. Exercise 2. Mm -hmm. Now, match the reviews to the headlines below. Okay. Can you read the first one, uh, Bogdan? <clears throat> Radiohead performed live in front of a packed stadium of rock fans last night. The stage was illuminated by spectacular lightning effects and the audience was roused by their old hits and newest releases. The second this is one, number three. That was number three, yes, that's right. The Bobby, second one. Bobby, could you read the second one? Uh, the latest exhibition at the National Gallery has paintings from the French masters such as Monet and Courbet. Mm -hmm. This one is focused on their landscape paintings. It also includes works of art create, created by other artists who were inspired by the French countryside. The paintings are separated in two arch open spaces and based upon two different art movements. The first room exhibits the impressionist and the second, the realists. The realists. So the first room exhibits the impressionist. Искам не съм да обърнеш внимание сега вече и на произношението си, Боби Денс. Защото все пак този урок си го минавал веднъж, сега го повтаряш. Предполагам, че си забравил почти всичко в него като текст. Но акцентувай и днес малко на произношението си. Хубава артикулация от начало до края звуковете. Добре. И така, Богдан. So this text is about which picture? Number the National one. Gallery, that's right. And Bogdan, the last one. Could you read it? Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet has been performed in British theaters uh, countless times, but the play has come to life one, uh, once more at the Cambridge Speaker Shakespeare Festival. There is a full house every night and audience are left uh, astonished by the great performance of the cast. So there is a full house. Тук как да казвам, че са продадени всички билети. Че къщата е пълна. There is a full house every night. Тоест от вас ще искам да почвате да наизустявате текстовете на изуст. Това е много добър начин да проговорите езика. Ще вие го разбирате, но още не можете да го използвате на това ниво което предполага, че трябва да започвате да, да, да не изостявате текстове, за да може да се качите на това ниво. And the audiences are left astonished by the great performances of the cast. Да, добре. And let's continue now with the next topic. And uh, this very good saying. Do you agree with the statement that a picture is worth a thousand words? What do you think? About that statement, it's uh, Napoleon Bonaparte who said I that. I agree with this statement. Yes. Why? Because the pictures is... Uh, uh, can express express um, more more than one word. Yes, 
a lot of emotion it can oh, show oh, um, mm -hmm. right so a picture yes and i i don't know why but i remember that saying i didn't know that it was napoleon bonaparte who said that but once i was in one of the comments of my university teachers they said that a picture is worth a thousand words so Една картина е еквивалентна на хиляда думи, което означава, че when you tell a story, always you should place a picture to bring emotions within the reader and to make the storytelling more interesting to read. Yeah? We know that when we were children, we didn't want to read books without illustrations. Okay, so let's move on and continue with the second part of the lesson. So we are given us we are given to read the, about the storyline and how the movie Avatar was made. To start with, mm -hmm. let me just go towards the text. Uh, check the meaning of these words and phrases. So I'll press the button. We'll repeat and we'll see the definition given next to the word. Okay, let's start. Computer generated imagery. Say it together. Computer, Computer generated, generated imagery. Imagery. Try to go to Computer generated imagery. Computer generated imagery. Images made by computer graphics. Computer no generirani obrazi. Nali? Имаме ли в някаква друга думичка конкретна в жаргон в компютрите за това? Компютърно генерирани образи, да. Образи генерирани, произведени от компютър. Yes, the next one is... Humanoid tribe. Humanoid tribe. A group of aliens who have human-like bodies with two arms, two legs and a head. Prehistoric skeletons were recently discovered a humanoid tribe which closely resemble today's Limers. Okay. Apply. Lagum, apply. Yes. Virtual image. Repeat. Virtual limit image. Virtual image. Box office hit. So that means a film success in terms of the number of tickets sold. Box office hit. Значи той бил hit. В бокс офисите на киносалоните. So, the next one. Motion capture techniques. Заедно двамата. Motion, Motion capture techniques. techniques. Facial expression. Facial expression. Lifelike. Човекоподобен. Lifelike. Lifelike. Live action scene. Live action scene. Той е сцени с на живо, които се изпълняват. That's what they say. Live action scene, a scene in a film that with real actors and sets. Live action scenes. And then simulation camera. Simulation camera, a special camera used to film animated sequences. And last one. Absorb. Absorb. Absorbirum, priemum. To interest somebody a great deal and take up all the attention. To absorb the attention. The, the privilege of so much that she didn't even notice that her friends were talking. She was so much absorbed. The film absorbed Julie's attention so much. Okay. Picture on the slide. And we are ready to move to the text. Now, what do you know about James Cameron's avatar? What else would you like to know about the movie? Write down three questions. Bogdan, have you seen Avatar? Yes. Bogdan? Yes, okay. And you, Bobby, have you seen Avatar? No, I don't. You haven't sure. seen it yet. Oh, so you have a good reason to see it tonight or maybe tomorrow, this weekend. Yes, because yeah. it's a, one of the most amazing movies I've ever seen in my life. It's an amazing movie. Yes. Bogdan, do you agree with me? Yes. 
Yeah, why I've watched do you? It yes, so many yes. times. You have seen it so many times. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. So you have never watched it? Uh, have you watched the South? Have you watched the trackers? Do we call them like that? Yes. I yes. Like yes. That. Yes. So there. Let me just see whether the video is about that. Yes. James Cameron from Titanic to Avatar. So it's about his life story. The video we are going to watch. But the um, yeah, from Titanic to Avatar. Let me just just to see whether this is gonna be about the movie. No, this is about his life. Ah, oh, there, there is a story tell about the movie. What he actually okay. Before we watch the video, let's go back to the text. Uh, so Bogdan, what do you think is the um, the message that James Cameron wants to send us? through the movie Avatar, the message that he sends to us. Mm -hmm. Maybe the message is... Uh... It's quite a complicated movie, by the way. It is not an easy movie to understand, but they wanted to protect what? The soul of the mother, the souls of the mother earth. Yeah, and that was the fight between the bad and the evil. Yeah. Yes. It was to do with our roots, with our own self. And it's an interesting journey, and the story is uh, is told in a fascinating way. Okay, so, but why James Cameron's uh, avatar is so good? Why is it so? Yeah, and can you guess, Bogdan? Why is the movie so well, was so well, uh, how to say, accepted by the audiences all over the world? Yeah? Because uh, it uh, has... Uh... This is the first word we introduced, computer-generated imagery, yeah? Yes. And that's the first, I think, 3D, three-dimensional movie that James Cameron has made. The first 3D film he has made. Which is like exploring new things in cinema, cinematography, in making films, yeah? Okay, so before you start reading the text, uh, do you have any questions you want to know about the topic? What you would like to know about Cameron's avatar? Yeah. What would you like to learn about the movie before we start reading it? Do you have any questions you want to ask? Bobby? No. no. Not really. For example, look at these uh, interesting characters. Maybe you can ask questions such as, uh, how are these uh, creatures made? Yeah? What yeah. kind of uh, a computer animated imagery they are using? Yeah, because they've used uh, new, new techniques, new, uh, they've used motion capture technologies and uh, this technology coincides with the movements and emotions of a human, uh, of a human, human person, of a human being. So this is uh, like uh, the discovery of the movie. They discovered a new way of of uh, following people's emotions. Mm -hmm. Okay. And Bogdan, have you got any questions you want to ask before we start the reading? No, I don't have any. Okay, so let's start reading the text. And listen and read the text. And after that, we'll answer the questions about it. I focus on the pronunciation of everything. The questions um, that are following a reading comprehension. So let's enjoy the reading first. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> A new dimension to art.
Computer-generated imagery, CGI, has greatly influenced and changed the way we see and do things that would have been impossible to even imagine before. Over the years, three-dimensional computer graphics and animation have been applied to all areas of the media, such as films, television programs and video games, to enhance the visual and special effects. Each project added new inventions or techniques to make the virtual images more realistic. But one film came along to combine the media and bring the technology many light years ahead. Avatar. When James Cameron, the director and creator of Avatar, first imagined the world of Pandora and the Navi humanoid tribe, there was no available technology to help him make his dream come true. He had to wait a few years for technology to catch up to him and finally start filming in 2001. Although CGI was widely used in many box office hits, there were some limitations. Motion capture techniques were used to create digital or animated characters. This was done by having actors wear suits full of markers with reflectors on them, which recorded their movements on a computer. Graphic artists would then combine these images with their 3D graphic designs and animation and produce realistic movement and action for their characters. However, this technology could not show detailed human expressions or realistic landscapes. Cameron found a way to do just that. In Avatar, the characters not only have a full range of natural body movements, but complete facial expressions as well. Cameron helped develop a one-of-a-kind technique to copy the movements of lips, eyes and mouths. Actors were given special headgear to wear equipped with a camera. As a result, Every muscle and eye movement was recorded and used to make the digital characters in the film truly authentic and lifelike. To make the world of Pandora even more realistic, many fields of knowledge were used and integrated with art. Experts in biology, engineering and physics worked closely with talented artists and illustrators to create this magnificent world. Great attention to detail was applied to each creature, character and the surrounding environment including every plant and leaf. Somehow, that wasn't enough for the director. He had to take it a step further. After years of dreaming about it, Cameron developed the first 3D camera that combined the live-action scenes with the computer-generated scenes. Video gaming technology was used along with a virtual camera and a simulation camera to create a virtual production stage for the director through a computer. But how is that possible, you might ask? CG images were sent to the virtual camera, while the simulation cam combined CG characters and the designed environments into the 3D fusion camera. After all, fusion means to join many things together to make one. All the director had to do was look through the eyepiece and direct these virtual scenes as if he would a live action scene. This had never been done before. With the use of state-of-the-art technology, a strong team of experts and creative artists and loads of imagination, the director had managed to interact with and control every aspect of the virtual film he was directing. The film Avatar, with its 3D effects, managed to absorb the audience into the world of Pandora and give them a feeling of interaction like that of a video game. While video games have not succeeded yet in creating such realistic 3D worlds for players, the groundbreaking technology used in the film will certainly lead the way. The same teams that worked on the film released a 3D Avatar game, but they are also working on improving the three-dimensional experience for future projects. Okay, let's now answer the questions about the text, okay? So, where was the film set? So now you refer, you have to refer to the text. Let me look. Where was the film set? Okay, maybe we should refer to it like that. This question.
Yes, so maybe the answer to the question is in the imaginary world of Pandora, into the world of Pandora. Yes, the film was set in the world of Pandora. It's an imaginary world of Pandora. That is the place where the activity, uh, where the film takes place. Who was the film directed by? Yes, we know, James Cameron. And, okay, let's now answer these questions. Read the article for questions one to six. Choose the answer which you think best fits according to the text. Okay. How does computer-generated imagery improve virtual images? Gobi, сега може би ти би могъл да си отвориш как, да, от, как компютъра да. и а, от телефона да гледаш въпросите. Because now you should refer to the paragraphs. It's a really comprehension task. So how does computer-generated imagery improve virtual images? Look at the answers. It makes them three-dimensional. It animates them. It combines all areas of the media. It makes them more believable and true to life. What do you think is the answer? It makes them three-dimensional. And I think it was more close to the real world. Yes, that was the last one. It was three-dimensional. Let's see the text. Where it says that. Yes, they have applied it to all areas of the media to enhance the visual and special effects. And as a result, they make the virtual images more realistic, like lifelike. Okay, the next question to refer to is question number, where are we now? This is question B, yes. The director of the film Avatar based it on a real tribe came up with the idea himself, saw it all in a dream, started filming immediately. Let's go back to the text, show the text. So it's about the director of the movie. Yes, it's there. So, graphic artists would then then combine these images with their beauty. However, this technology could not show detailed human expressions. Cameron found its own way to do just that. So, Cameron helped develop a one-of-a-kind technique to copy the movements of lips, eyes, and mouths. Toys, even toys is dealt as it. Техно, техника, при която са се копирали движението на устата, устните, очите и устата. Ето са ги има специал хайски гир, че са екипирани с камера. As a result, every muscle and eye movement was recorded and used to make digital characters in the film truly offending and lifelike. And to make the world of Pandora even more realistic, many kinds of knowledge were used and integrated with art. Somehow, that wasn't enough, but for the director, he had to take it a step further. So great attention to detail was applied to each creature, character, and the surrounding environment, including every plant and leaf. But that wasn't enough. And finally, after years of dreaming, Cameron developed the first 3D camera that combined the live action scenes with the computer generated scenes. Значи той е измислил каква, измислил някаква камера, видеокамера, която е комбинирала живите сцени от живите действия с компютърно генерирани сцени. Video gaming technology was used along with a virtual camera and a simulation camera to create a virtual production stage with a director through a computer. But how is that possible, you might ask? Just computer generated images were sent to the virtual camera with a simulation cam combined CG characters and a designed environment taking a 3D fusion camera. After all, fusion means to join and many things together to make one. Because I had to say that the first thing 
че той е създал някаква камера, която е успяла да събере движенията на тялото и на камерата. So, the director of the film Avatar based it on a real tribe, came up with the idea himself, saw it all in a dream, started filming immediately. Came up with the idea himself. Къде го видя това като отговор? Мисли си, че е това? Да, я да видим. Ми няма как да е някакъв другите. Да, there was no available technology to help. So, he first imagined the world of Pandora and now the humanoid tribe. Т.е. той си го е измислил сам си мичък. The next question is to do with the writer finds Cameron's headgear. Така, намира неговите, неговият headgear, original, very realistic, not good enough, or beautiful. Line 33. Я да видиме къде е тази линия. Line 33. What does he think about the Had gear, actually. Across were given actors were given special had gear to wear equipped with a camera. То е смисъл от тук, който влага в had gear. What kind of had gear? The writer finds Cameron's had gear original, realistic, not good enough, beautiful. Maybe original. Because no one has ever done it before, so he was the first one to do it. But he develops a one-of-a-kind technique to copy the development of movement of lips, eyes, and mouth. Okay. And next question. Bobby, can you read question number four? Specialists were used to study to study the world of Pandora, to visit the world of Pandora, to create a believable environment, to record all movements. Да видим какво е станало. Значи дали сте изучавали, посещавали, явно не е първо и второ. Може би е четвъртото, последното. They were used to record all movements. Нали, предполагам, че това е около. C, to create a believable environment. Let's see the answer. Closely with talented artists and illustrators to create this magnificent world. Great attention to detail was applied to each character and the surrounding environment, including every plant and leaf. Okay, the next question is... Bogdan, question five. Can you try question five? Bogdan, are you there? According to the text, what did Cameron accomplish in this film? Accomplish. Accomplish. Postigan of this film. What does he accomplish? He introduced... He introduced innovative technology to the field. Yes. Maybe that's what they want to say. Introduce innovative, innovative technology to the field. Yes. And the last one. Uh, In paragraph, you will learn that that avatar. Was authentic. No, has yes, successfully helped. Това зависи от текста. If you go back to the text in the last paragraph, what do they say? Let me just refer back to the question. It managed to absorb the audience into the world of Pandora and give them a feeling of interaction like this. That a video game. Малко бъркваш този въпрос, нали? While video games have not succeeded yet in creating such realistic 3D world for players, the groundbreaking technology used in the film will certainly lead the way. The same teams that worked on the film released 3D avatar game, but they are also working on improving the three-dimensional experience for future projects. 
също работи върху подобряването на триизмерните three-dimensional experience for future projects. Добре. That's it. We did it. Браво. And question number four. Answer the questions using your own words. Why did it take Cameron a long time to produce Avatar? Why? Bogdan, do you remember? Why? He couldn't make the film for so long. Because there was no available technology to help him make. Yes, make. Right. very well now. Yeah, the answer is yeah. yeah. It took him a long time to produce Avatar because the technology he needed was not developed yet. He had to wait for some of the technology to be invented and he invented some himself so that he could take make the film the way he wanted to make it. And last question, how did Cameron manage to combine live action scenes with computer generated scenes? Let's look at the text. С помощта на какво? Live action scenes with computer generated scenes. С помощта на какво ти беше свързал? Живите сцени с просто пак да видя с компютърните сцени с помощта на manage with a computer. Yes. Yes. Like a computer. He used a special headgear as well. Aha, uh -huh. no, that's he used a virtual camera and a simulation camera to create a 3D fusion camera. He created that fusion camera that combined both the virtual camera and the movements of the body of the actor in one action. Okay. And that's it. Uh, so we should identify and find the words in the text that mean the same. Affected. Can you say another word for affected in English language? Can you guess? In paragraph A, this is in paragraph A. It's on the first line. Повлиян, въздейства. Influenced. Influenced. That's what they say. Influenced. Can you read about them? The other words? Was developed. In paragraph A, where that means the same, беше развит. Maybe it has been applied to in paragraph A. I'm looking at the text. It is not even just that it needs to make the virtual image more realistic and more bring the technology many lights here ahead. А може би последното изречение. Bring the technology many years ahead. Maybe yes. Това ще бъде the last sentence. Е, още една дума са ни дали. Да, пак послед. But one film came along to combine the media and bring the technology many years ahead. Okay, broadly, in paragraph B. Bobby, имаш ли го текста пред себе си сега? Имаме го, да. Айде сега, ти гледай текст там. So, which word in paragraph B also means broadly? What is broadly? Това ли ще бъде? Я да проверим. Or widely. Widely. Тя е хубаво да си чете. Сега целта на тази... Широко означава. А широко разпространен. Widely known. Widely known. Broadly known. Навсякъде по света. Widely. Тоест, да, it's to do with spreading something, spreading the information. Join together in paragraph B. Свързваме, не беше ли мърч? Обаче я видим дали има друг глагол, който да има подобно значение. To join together, сливам. К 
combine is the word. Uh -huh. Did you find the word? It's on line 23. Graphic artists would then combine these images with their 3D graphic designs and animation and produce, what do they produce? Realistic movement and action for their characters. Produce in paragraph C. Produce. Develop, maybe. Mm, could be develop. And make and develop. Okay. Really, in the same paragraph, really. Complete, maybe, something to do with reality, truly, it's to do with truly. Combined. Integrated. Maybe, could be integrated to this. And in paragraph E, the very last paragraph, fascinate by the link. Which one did you say? Absorb, yeah? Absorb the attention. Absorb. Sense? Yeah? Sense in paragraph E. Сенси, като усещам, чувствам. Филинг. Коя? Филинг. Филинг. Добре. Има ли е някъде? Я да видим ли това е мишката. Филинг. That's right. And made available to the public. Това ще бъде... Аха, ето, аз го видях. Line 66, the same teams that work on the field released, made available to the public. Пускам в обращение за разпространяване. You release a film or a book. Released. That's it. Okay, and now... Use the amenities in each paragraph to give the class a summary of the text. I'll drop this part, but no, no, I'm not gonna tell the same story. Let's move on to the next activity. What makes Avatar a special film? In three minutes, write a few sentences. Tell your partner all the class. Bob the name. Do you have a few words to say about Avatar? Did you like it? If you say yes, why? Yes, because uh, it uh, is a 3D movie and uh, it has uh, better technology in it than the movies before it. Yeah. And it's fun to watch. Yeah. It's actually, it has a wonderful dancing. It has a wonderful imagery, lightning. I think it's a fascinating movie and it's a must. You should watch it. Let's go. Okay. And um, that's it. So let's do some more questions to do about the movie the text we've just read on page 72 in the book vocabulary from the text read and complete the gaps with one of these words. Robert? 
when art and another discipline combine integrate their results in something very impressive integrate their results yes Bobby uh, he was able to produce something that looks like the original of uh, copy the great masterpiece. Mm -hmm. Copy. Ne. Copy. Nechi. That looks like the original or copy. The great masterpiece. Okay. Bogdan. James Cameron invented, uh, developed the first 3D camera. Mm -hmm. Developed. Okay. Bob, Bob. Uh, the studio was provided. How do you say it was? Oborudano? Uh, equipped. 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 What? Equipped. Equipped oh. with all the latest 3D cameras and virtual production stages. Da, okay. Bogdan? Computer generated images improve in. Da, dumičkate enhance. Enhance označava za silvom, pod silvom dejstvito na nešto. Enhance. За всичко ли можеш да използваш? Ами да, за силвам. Особено когато подчертаваш думите. Подсилваме действието на нещо с enhance. Enhance. Да. And the next one. Bom. The experience was made more real. Authentic. Because of the light like characters. Mm -hmm. Okay, to that one. It was authentic. Because of the lifelike folklore yes, of children. Lifelike children. Okay. And now write the story about James Cameron. You have to write a summary of the text. Bob, can you try please? When James Cameron made his dream come true with Avatar, he combined the way he Yeah, who is gonna continue? Applied the way mm -hmm. in the integration of CGI and 3D. Applied the way let maybe or I don't know. maybe combined. No, yeah. let. Uh, led the way. Aha, uh -huh. that to lead the way. Lead. To lead the way in the integration of computer generated imagery and 3D technology to create a film that. that combine action and combine live action and animation to create a realistic cinematic experience. He made the audience feel like they could interact with the characters in the film, motion capture technologies. Uh, of recording actors movement or i think of the past and the new technology can now be applied to other films to expand the genre further very well now so that was the summary of the text about james cameron Обаче имахме едно видео, което пропуснахме, но ще се върнем към него малко по-късничко. So, fill in the gaps with these words. Bobby, can you start, please? 
influenced. How could you get influenced? Силно повлиял, значи твърди с great. Greatly. Продължи. What kind of images? Animated. 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 Yeah. Oh, animated, maybe virtual in this context. Virtual, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, box office hits. Box office hits. Okay. Characters. An animated characters. Animated. Expressions can be, can be fake. And the movements would be? Eye expert, uh, eye movements. Eye movements, точно така. Eye movements. To work. Closely. Okay, closely, yes. With a next one. To take something a step further. A step further. To take something a step further. What kind of knowledge is it? Maybe fields of knowledge. And finally, it's going to be a production stage. A production stage. Yes, that's right. Okay. So we've done this now. Come on. It's okay. Остана ни задача, а вече продължаваме с vocabulary. What's to do with art, music, TV, literature, theater and film? Let's place the words based on their genre. So when we talk about art, всъщност направо ще ги извадим до учките, we use all of these vocabulary. Okay? Bogdan, read all the vocabulary we need to know about art. Canvas, os, Paintbrush, paintings, and portraits. Mm -hmm. Okay, are you familiar with these words? What is canvas? Canvas is a No, we use canvas to paint on. Plotno, very soon. Well, Bobby, if you talk about music, you need this type of vocabulary. What uh, ceremony, instrument, melody, re reversal. Go stage. Okay, stage. Well, TV. Bogdan, what does it say about TV? Acts, cameraman, drama, episode, premiere, series, special effects, stunt, what is stunt? Stunt acrobatic number. Такъв не акробатичен, а по-скоро на каскадьор. Номер на каскадьор. Страшен, който включва доза риск. Номер на каскадьор или каскадьора? Това е номерът. Самият номер, каскадьорския номер е стант. Тоест, когато някой каже We have a stunt tonight, значи имат пори, че ще имат номер на каскадьор. Да, да. Стант е самият номер, който се изиграва. Стант. Окей? Да, това, което стант е... Значи това е на български язик номер, който включва определена доза риск за живота. А стант. He is going to do a stunt. Каскадьорски номер. Well, literature, these are different types of literature, theater and films. Are you familiar with these words? Познати ли са тези думички всичките? Свъзени с киното. That's something to do with the same. Yes. I'm going to the theatre as well. Okay, so you are expected to be able to recognize these words. Okay, and let's continue with exercise five. What is uh, rehearsal? Rehearsal and repetition. It will be called rehearse, repetition, rehearsal, repetition. Okay. Добре. Така, така те стигнахме сега, стигнахме до следващата задачка. It's about my favorite actress, Meryl Streep. And you have to choose the correct word for her, fill in the gaps. Okay? Bobby, can you start, please? 
Meryl Streep began her career as a theater actress is in the late 60s. She started uh, Yes, she started, she started appearing, uh, appearing appearing in in films in the 17s and has surprised uh really up my grade surprised is an anatomy какво може да бъде изненадващ е може би роли or roles roles with her challenging може би е surprise surprise the audience audiences okay with her yes. challenging with her challenging roles and mm -hmm. outstanding and outstanding performances mm -hmm. that have uh, our yes um that, yeah firm for many nominations and awards yes. um, i think uh, super boy in comedy drama and musicals she's one of the most gifted film actresses today excellent <laughs> And so today is lesson in text. Uh, so there is a video to watch now about acting. Meryl Streep, Hollywood's greatest living film. So before we do the video about her, you should listen and get this information. Meryl Streep had only studied acting before she became a theater actor. True or false? Do you know that? I don't. No. In 78, Streep worked alongside her fiancé in The Deer Hunter. Streep won an Academy Award for the performance in The Deer Hunter. Streep starred opposite Don Kramer in Kramer vs. Kramer. I think this uh, film brought her another Oscar to her. Streep accepted the and won an Oscar in 1980. Streep had never been and never had the chance to work in an animated film, Viarno in Viarno. And Street is a talented singer and she is able to imitate people's voices. True or false? Let's do it. No, I don't want to quit. Meryl Streep, Hollywood's greatest living film actress. She is considered by many to be the greatest film actress of all time. Today we'll be taking a look at the life and career of Meryl Streep. Don't wait up. Mary Louise Streep was born June 22, 1949 in Summit, New Jersey. As a child, Streep loved music and practiced as an opera singer. She eventually began acting lessons and this unearthed her passion for performance. She studied drama at a variety of notable schools, including the Yale School of Drama. Streep then took part in a number of major theater productions, and through these efforts she met and became engaged to actor John Cazale. She also auditioned for the lead in the 1976 remake of King Kong, but was turned away when producer Dino De Laurentiis announced she was too unattractive for the role. Instead, Streep made her film debut in 1977's Julia. At the time, she was living in New York with Cazale when they discovered he had contracted terminal bone cancer. In an effort to spend as much time together as possible, the pair found work in 1978's The Deer Hunter. Streep then landed the starring role in the television miniseries Holocaust. In that project, she played a German woman who was married to a Jewish artist at the outbreak of the war. Unfortunately, when her overseas shooting finally ended, she returned home to find her fiancé's illness had 
had worsened. He died soon afterwards. In the wake of this tragedy, she received a primetime Emmy for her role in Holocaust and an Academy Award nomination for her part in The Deer Hunter. By the end of the 70s, Streep took on even more critically acclaimed roles. These included her part in Woody Allen's romantic comedy Manhattan and the 1979 political drama The Seduction of Joe Tynan. That same year, she won a Golden Globe for Best Supporting Actress for her part opposite Dustin Hoffman in Kramer vs. Kramer. Meanwhile, she married sculptor Don Gummer. Streep accepted many leading roles throughout the 1980s. These movies included the drama The French Lieutenant's Woman and the psychological thriller Still of the Night. Streep then became involved with Robert De Niro in Falling in Love and played a self-destructive woman in 1985's Plenty. Do you never find it in yourself to despise a profession in which nobody may speak their mind? The latter half of the decade saw Streep co-star with Robert Redford in Out of Africa. She almost had me for lunch. Well, it wasn't her fault, Barry. She's a lion. And Jack Nicholson in both Heartburn and Ironweed. Streep earned further praise for portraying a woman convicted of murdering her infant in 1988's Cry in the Dark. <laughs> before she entertained crowds with much lighter comedic fare in 1989's She-Devil. Overall, the actress claimed six People's Choice Awards for favorite motion picture actress in the years leading up to the 90s. That decade saw Streep in films like 1992's black comedy, Death Becomes Her, opposite Goldie Hawn and Bruce Willis. Badly, look at yourself. Huh? She continued taking diverse roles by appearing opposite Clint Eastwood in The Bridges of Madison County and by starring in The River Wild and Marvin's Room. At the turn of the millennium, Streep was cast in Steven Spielberg's AI, Artificial Intelligence. Dearest David, your wish is my command. Spike Jones's adaptation and alongside Nicole Kidman in The Hours. She even played a supporting role in Lemony Snicket's A Series of Unfortunate Events before being honored with a 2004 AFI Lifetime Achievement Award. I'm, I'm so proud and, and grateful, and uh, uh, I hope it's not the end. <laughs> However, her most prominent projects from this period were The Devil Wears Prada, the musical Mamma Mia, and Julie and Julia, in which she played chef and TV personality Julia Child. Ready? <laughs> Bonjour! Streep even lent her voice to Wes Anderson's stop-motion adaptation of Roald Dahl's The Fantastic Mr. Fox. If what I think is happening is happening, it better not be. In 2011, she was cast as former British Prime Minister Margaret Thatcher in the biopic The Iron Lady. Meryl Streep boasts countless talents, including the ability to sing and flawlessly imitate accents. I'm Baroness Blitzen. This, paired with her willingness to take on dynamic roles, has garnered her much praise and recognition over her career. Her staggering number of Academy Award nominations and wins has made her the most critically acclaimed actress in contemporary film. I thank you all very much. Yes, actually she's much famous than Meryl Streep. Have you heard about her before? Yes, I've seen her. You've seen her, yes, yes. And I really like her movie, uh, The Bridges of Medicine. It's a love uh, movie and I really loved it. And when I watched it, I really cried. It's so emotional. So uh, let's answer the questions about the video you watched. So, yeah, can you complete the gaps about Mary? Yes, Streep. Street began her career as a theater actress in the late 60s. Yes. She started. She started maybe appearing. Yes. Appearing in films in the 70s and has surprised uh, audiences with her challenging, mm -hmm. outstanding, mm -hmm. and <laughs> It's a challenging rose. Yes. Performances. Yeah. That have earned her many nominations and mm -hmm. awards. And awards. 
Act. Acting superbly in comedy, drama, and musicals, she's one of the most gifted film actors today. Temata za TVs and radios, that's here. So you should complete this particular list with these words. I watch. Yes. Okay. What do you watch, Bobby? What kind of affairs? Това е телевизионните предавания, те са новини. Так, новина е к, к. Карен. Current affairs е новините. Current affairs program to keep up to date with position events around the world. We should watch the weather forecast before we plan our hiking trip. Did you see that Documentary about the penguins in Antarctica. Documentary, yes. Okay. Which radio station offers the best sports highlights? Highlights, yes, that's right. The best. So we are doing. Uh -huh. It's going to be cover it. Cover it. To click it. Yes. We are doing some research into the. Into the what habit of teenagers? Nachi Virku Nai Vajnite Navitsi, maybe into the highlights. Convincing. Convincing, so to be legatomy. Kakrisa there, do you read into the highlights of habits? Viewing habits, then I'm going to viewing. What is this about? Ah, viewing. Ah, this is the Navitis, the Gledon and the Televisia. We're doing some research into the viewing habits of teenagers. Those, how long they watch TV a day, for example. Yes? Who is next, Bogdan? The actor started to laugh when he forgot his lines. When he forgot his lines. Then the bloody see that click it. Watch watch highlights and previews of new programs coming through to CBS. She won the best actress award for her convincing performance in the TV miniseries. Super. Между другото, останалите бихте могли и да се ги направите в къщи, но искам да ви препоръчам една програма, която е много скъзва за издаване на фрази, директно от филми. Аз си бях споделила във Фейсбук. Вие следите ли моите постове във Фейсбук? Искам да споделя с вас нещо по-интересно, защото ми става малко време до край на чето. Тези упражнения можете и самички да си ги довършите. Но сега ще малко, искам малко да разнообразя с нещо по-забавно. Значи ще напишем, ето тук в YouTube, Learning English with the films. Това са така ли беше? English films with, Learning English with films. Мисля, че това беше само да... Да. Ето тази поредица Learn English с е много подходяща, много интересна, много забавна, с най-възможните интересни филми и много добре се... Ето, ей, точно имаме и за Аватар. Айде ще изгледаме това. Не, на екрана няма нищо. А, аз не съм го споделила, извинявайте. А от чаш ще е The Screen. Това е много добър начин да си подобрите речни като думи. Е, сега ще го споделя екрана ми. А, къде ми ти да е екрана? Ето. Сега виждате ли? Ето, learn English with Avatar. Learn English with Friends, with Shrek. Това са learn English with Tom Hanks. Много хубаво, но тъй като говорихме днеска за Avatar, хайде да го направим по-интересен. Това видео е 22 минути. 
ще се го започвам да го гледаме. Вие можете да си го довършите в къщи, само да включа. How to learn English with movies. Просто трябва да използваме тези нови... Ам... English through movies, Avatar. Чудесно, тъкно ще съвпадне с нашата тема днес. They've sent us a message that they can take whatever they want. But we will send them a message. That this, this is all I have. Oh yeah, today you're going to learn some advanced English vocabulary with the hit film Avatar. But before we do, I wanted to quickly let you know that if you're new here, every week we make fun lessons with your favorite movies and more so that you can understand fast speaking natives without getting lost, without missing the jokes, and without subtitles. Like Krishna, who says that because of our people, like he can speak more like a native, and you can too, all you have to do is hit that subscribe button and the bell. Така, така, така. Ето сега тук ще ви пусна линка. Искам след урока да си изгледате този филм. Това кратко видео, 20 минутно. Но много хубаво, защото това ви дава как да разбирате филма, когато го гледате в оригинал. Така. И така, хайде да го направим. А, значи това ще остане за домашна работа, нали, да го изгледате. Малко да разнобриза, да ви бъде по-интересен часа, но продължаваме тогава с учебника. Let's complete the text with the, uh, the rest of the vocabulary from your book. We are doing now vocabulary on music, newspapers, magazines, idioms, word formation and phrasal. Да ще стигнем. Правиме доста материал в момента. Това е материал за две учебни занятия. А вие, защото сте бързи двамата, успяхме да го а направим за два учебни часа. Не за четири, а за два учебни часа. Така, хайде сега да продължим с uh, vocabulary from unit 5 vocabulary. Ето тук. This one. Добре. Music. Окей. Okay. Now, Bogdan, can you continue, please? The band is... Uh... Recording a new album. Her new single will be released in record stores this month. Okay. Next one. 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 Her new single will be released in record stores this month. Okay, next one. No, third quarter. Mm -hmm. Next one, uh, Bobby. Oh. What would you see? Backing, backing singers sing in harmony with the lead vocalist. Yeah. Support. What does that mean? Те подкрепам, support не се използва при пеенето. Support се използва в support в, да кажем, computer, computer technologies. But back vocal е в пеенето. Backing singers, back vocal. Окей? Okay? Yeah, Богдан. It took the composer years to write his most famous opera. Okay. It costs less to uh, download music from online music stores than to buy a CD. It costs less to download music than to buy a CD, yes. You can book tickets for the concert online or in 
person at the box uh, of. Mm -hmm. Da, dobre. You can book it and then get it from the box office. Bravo. Mi malku pomošt about uh, these words. Let me know just... Um, just have to... I want to just take a picture of this slide. And continuing with the next one. It's about newspaper and magazines. Okay, Bobby, this is what kind of magazine that focuses on the glamorous lifestyles of celebrities? It uh, is. Sorry. Uh, Can you follow the computer screen? Yes. Uh, mm -hmm. This is. is uh, glamorous life. Yeah. Това е за, за блестящите начини на животни и знаменитости. Явно, че става дума about what kind of uh, magazine? Tabloid uh, magazine. Трябва да бъдат лъскави. Uh, gloss. Gloss. Yes. gloss magazine that focus on the glamour lifestyle. Лъскав списание, така ли? Лъскав, лъскав, да. Глоси магазин. Значи, заговорим за това, че кориците са му бляскави. А какво е таблоид? Таблоидите, това е жълтата преса. The tabloid. Е, сега ще го обясня. Тук имаме хелм бутон. Uh, the tabloid a small sized newspaper containing light articles and gossip. Жълтата преса е това. All the tabloids Ran front page photos of the scandal. Така, editorial е най-главната статия на първа страница. The part of the newspaper where the editor writes their comments. The Islam's editorial. Главната статия на вестник. Editorial. Ма главната като че най-отпред или просто най-важна? Когато е най-отпред, когато е на първа страница, това е обикновено от страницата на редактора на навестника и тя се води като editorial. Там, където всъщност главният редактор води своите коментари. Editorial. Обикновено това е първа страница. This month's editorial focus on the success of Spielberg's new film and the editor made it clear that He had enjoyed the film a month. A headlines? Passa the glavieta. The glavieta. Ah, da, verno, verno. Headlines, the words in large letters above a newspaper story. The headlines, glossy of a magazine printed on shiny, high quality paper. Lusk of the Hatia, column and colonna of a vesnica. I read Jane Andrews column on the new modern art exhibition today. Morning paper, the morning edition of the daily newspaper. Aha, сутрешно издание на някой ежедневник. Today's morning paper carried the news of a yesterday's earthquake. Тоест като вестник или? Като сутрешен вестник, да, който се издава сутрин, да. Иначе е обидно. То всичките се издават сутрита, в принцип. The morning edition of a daily newspaper. Да, сутрешното издание. Е, да, всички се издават от линда, да си прав. Да, morning paper. Но може би има някои вестници, които имат по две издания. И вероятно това е същото издание на някой ежедневник, който... I don't know why I mean so, but the morning paper is the morning... A broach it, какво е на третото? Коя думичка? Approach, е доближавам се. Broach it. Broad sheet. Аха, а тук като го няма иначе, но аз ще ти кажа, това са, обикно, това са сериозните вестници. Broad sheets. Къде сме само да се върна назад? Къде? Broad sheet. Това са, това са сериозните вестници, при които вече страници са в по-голям размер. И има повече информация и са от достоверни източници, а не като от таблоидите, от недостоверни източници. Когато имаме, сега това е A tabloid newspaper is smaller than a broad sheet от нормалните сериозни вестници. Тоест, таблоид трябва да е, нали? Tabloid, точно така. Тук ще бъде a tabloid. Stories in the Atlas is a editorial magazine. 
editorial magazine, uh, no, glossy magazine that focuses on lives. Uh, reads the last several columns. Moria? Today's newspaper devoted several columns to the subject of the upcoming elections. Mm -hmm. no. Laura's article was selected as the headlines for this week's edition of the magazine. Mm -hmm. Editorial. Главната статия. Editorial. It's in the next is headlines. Mm -hmm. This was brought past the news agent. He quickly read the headlines. Yeah, it's just like that. And the last idioms. We make them and we conclude them. Like that. Bring the house down. All these phrases are explained in the order you do. Can you guess the meanings by reading the paragraphs? Четеме и отгадваме кой според вас ще пасне на тези идиоматични фрази. So, Богдан, can you read the first one? She sank with her full effort and energy at the audition. Може би е... Тай да само едно със пеене. И това е... Sing one's heart out. One's heart. Да си спееш сърцето. Sing out. She sang her heart out. А може ли да се използва и в други контексти? Не, не, не. Тук е да... Е точно това е означение. Да изпееш нещо с енергия, от сърце. Тя си изпя сърцето. She sang her heart out at the audition. Well, Bobby? She was the outstanding performer in the critical production. Maybe you the show. Maybe it's the audience. Yeah, this will be stole the show. Yeah, he took the show. He stole 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 the show. He was the outstanding performer. He stole the show in the theatrical production. Okay. The rock band excited the audience. Watch. The house down. So, why Frachkata? The room where they played their hit song. I see the Zulnovali said, the cover step and Kustata Chitia Bila Razushena Divin brought the house down. Okay, next, Bogdan. Despite his uh, worldwide fame, he still managed to mm -hmm. to have uh, sweet. Ne, ne. Tu kada stoji zdravo na zemljata, razbiraš li ima razbiraš? One feet on the ground. Keep her feet on the ground. To je his feet on the ground. Da stoji razumno na zemljata, da ne leti v oblacite. Despite his worldwide fame, he still manages to Keep his feet on the ground. His latest film won all the major prizes. Sweep the board. The board. Minul to vreme ne sweep is swept the board. Kak se prevežda bukvalno? Mi one zel sički glavni nagradi. Swept the board. Значи измел, sweep, swap, swap, е помитам, измитам. Взела всички възможни главни награди е the awards ceremony. Вижте, тук няма буквален превод, тук трябва да знаете смисъла. Те за това са и доматични празички, защото имат различен смисъл. А, brought the house down, как се превежда буквално на български? We the excited the audience означава, когато е пълна, пълен театър или стадиона, с хора и публиката е много развълнувана, те всъщност bring the house down. Едно, че... Събарят къщата. Събарят къщата буквално е, да. Развълнуваната публика brought the house down. The rock band brought the house down. Т.е. събориха къщата. Толко бяха развълнувани. Това е като израз excited the audience. 
Ето ви като фрази, отново ги имаме зададени. Let's take a picture of these expressions. Bring the house down to make the audience laugh, laugh, hear loudly for a long time because they like the performance. The comedian Jock really brought the house down. The audience couldn't stop laughing. Keep my feet on the ground. Fire is behind The bullshit is human. To sing your heart out. Think to the best of your ability. Feel the show to get a lot of attention or praise because I perform better than anyone else in a show or other event. And sweep the board to win everything that is available. So, the special Sitchki Nagari could serve with me. Sweep the board. Okay? Bye. За днес ще приключваме. Ще ви оставя за домашно да си довършите фрейза от Breaths and Prepositions и цялата тази лексика в работната тетрадка. Боби, тези упражнения в тетрадката, свързани с тази тема. Пак ще ги минеш. Дори ли си ги направил с компютърната версия на учебника? Мини ги втори път, трети път. Можете също да направите в тетрадката Reading Comprehension. Art or Science Vocabulary on page 54-55. То е 52-54-5 за домашна работа за следващата седмица. Окей? Да има ли които? Не. Окей, добре. Боби, имаш ли някакъв проблем за това, че минаваме пак този материал? Отново? Не, аз даже това нямам спомен да сме го минали точно това. Може и да си пропуснал точно този урок. Може да съм го пропуснал. Но дори и да сме го правили, при всяко повторение ти научаваш нещо ново. Не обръщаш внимание на нова домичка, нещо, което си го позабравил, го автоматизираш. Той учебник и 20 пъти да го минете, пак ще има какво да научите от него. Ето вижте сега тези идиоматични изрази, и аз не ги знам всичките. Просто то се набива в главата, по-малко, по-малко всеки ден и се запаметяват. Тези, например, sweep the board, не ми е активно, bring the house down. Тези последните не са ми използваеми. Другите ги знаем ги ползвам, но bring the house down. Значи днес може би това трябва да запомним от този урок, тези два израза. The musicians, the comedians joke brought the house down. Down and grab the board to win all the prizes. With the board, okay. Чудесно. Добре. Thank you very much. Ще се видим до следващата седмица. Да. Have a nice weekend. Tomorrow is the first of May, and then on the third of May, which is Saint George's Day. Maybe at home with family and friends. Okay. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.